you for joining us on this Memorial Day weekend. Uh, are you warming up the coffee or maybe the tea and trying to decide, oh, what jam will go with my toast? Well, we've got something else for you. How about povatitsa? I think I said it right. <laughs> it is a wonderful European bread. And so it started out with, you could say, a little Croatian boy who loved his grandmama's cooking. And povatica is this wonderful handmade rolled bread. Look at that. All the ingredients are fresh. And when you order this, they cook it that day and then deliver this handmade rolled bread to your front door. It is absolutely delicious. So I wanna bring in Ed Reyes, who works with Stra Strawberry Hill Povatica Company. And uh, we had to practice this. It's Povo. Pizza. Povo. Pizza. There you go. <laughs> so you got it? Povo. Pizza. <laughs> well, good morning to you. Good morning. I'm so excited. If, I wish you could smell how wonderful this aroma is. Let's take everyone through the flavors. It's 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 not only you know beautiful, it's delicious. So let's start over here. You get four flavors, each one pound each in one package. This is a fantastic deal. So let's tell them what we're getting. Well, in the classic pack, we're having the apple cinnamon, okay. which is uh, Washington apples, cinnamon, uh, swirled in our, in our rolled bread. Povatica means swirled bread, so that's what we have here. We have the uh, uh, strawberry cream cheese, Ooh. which is almost like having cheesecake yes. in a bread. Amazing. Uh -huh. Amazing. We have... Uh, the white chocolate cherry, which is Ghirardelli white chocolate rolled up with uh, ch mom's cherry pie recipe, all whipped up into uh, the rolled breads. And at last, we have our traditional English walnut. It's a very traditional uh, recipe, classic recipe. That's the best seller that we have uh, right the now. The walnut. Yes. Oh, my goodness, because you could actually take this walnut um, and make make cinnamon toast or French oh, bread. Oh yeah, there's or... so many things you can do with it. I mean, I mean this you, looks great. I'm what, we, take a bite. what I usually like to do is just warm it up for, for five or 10 seconds in the microwave, and mm. then you put a pat of butter on it, have it with your coffee or cappuccino, and it's just an amazing thing to have in the morning. This is so good. Oh my goodness. I'm telling you, if you want to get the auto ship, that's what you should do. <laughs> <laughs> you can get this every month, every 60 days, fresh they cook it that day and then ship it to your door it's delicious and uh, we have it on five flex so everything that you're seeing here it's five flexible payments until monday at midnight free shipping so if you've never tried this european favorite what grandmama made i love this story oh yes um, the reviews are excellent if you want to take a look at the reviews because it's just so delicious and it, it's so moist it is it's very dense each loaf is is like you said hand rolled and we use mm. fresh ingredients and lots of them that's the thing we don't skimp on any of the ingredients that goes inside the filling mm -hmm. uh, usually is spread hand spread onto the paper thin dough and so like for example in the one pound loaf of the english walnut mm -hmm. there is 12 ounces of english walnut and that's what i love 12 ounces of english walnut yeah so you want to get this home. Auto ship is our most limited. We have under 200 left in auto ship. The last time it was here, it was in December. And uh, no, I'm sorry. It was uh, sold out last July that we had this. Right. Completely sold out. So this goes quickly. Look at that, the beautiful marbling. Talk about the, the, the ribbon, the, the marbling. How, how does that occur? So essentially what we've got is, like I said, we have a, a paper, we roll the dough paper thin, mm. and then they put the filling on top and they use a special technique of rolling it, setting it up into an S shape into a, uh, into the uh, cake pan, mm -hmm. uh, they'll spread the, uh, in this case we're spreading white chocolate, mm, mm -mm. Uh, Ghirardelli chocolate on top of the cherry filling. Uh, there the, you see they roll it up, they form it into an S shape, and then put it into the, uh, the cake pan. Uh, each day that we, we make this fresh for all of our orders, we, and then we spread some 2% uh, milk, and in this case we're putting walnuts on the classic walnut, and 12 ounces of, of walnut? 12 ounces 12 of walnut, ounces. yes. It's not like you're gonna take one bite and not get a, a, a nut. I mean, it's gonna be really delicious so that each bite you get the walnut. And that strawberry and the cherry, oh, yeah. it's so summer. We're heading into summer, and what right. I love about this is we're having guests. Exactly. So you may have guests this Memorial Day weekend as you're celebrating a memory. Uh, July 4th is coming up after that. Maybe going to a picnic. This is something you can take with you, and it's special. 
not only the story of this being third generation, uh, you know, recipe passed down from grandmama, but it, it's great ingredients, like the apples are coming from Washington State. Everything's fresh, so the apples are fresh, the strawberries, the cherries, it's all natural ingredients. Look at this right here. Yeah. Do you want some ice cream? <laughs> <laughs> Any ice cream, anybody? It's apple pie. Look at how apple pie a la mode. <laughs> this is summer. This is a slice of USA here, right? That's right. I mean, this is delicious. So what kind of ice cream do we have here with a little bit of this? I mean, I should not be eating ice cream this early in the morning, <laughs> but I feel like I have to do a demonstration. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, it is delicious. Not only does it look delicious, it's delicious. Tell us the story of, because you're friends with the family. Right, I'm friends of Mark and Dennis O'Leary. And he's Croatian. He's Croatian, okay. and his father started the bakery. This is so uh, good, oh my goodness. Many years ago in Kansas City. I know they've been baking since 1903. Mm -hmm. So it's a family tradition, and Mark and his kids are looking to carry through the tradition. Mm -hmm. And I've been around the family, and I've watched it grow, and it's been it's an amazing trip for them to have gone through. So, and explain, for a person who's, who's never tasted uh, povetizza. Did I say it right? <laughs> That's povetizza. Right. povetizza. Or povetizia, as some people will say. <laughs> mm -hmm. But if you've never tried this, it's, it's you know, it's a little bit like a croissant to me in the layering and how yeah. fresh it is. Yeah. It's, and it's a little people, bit like a cake. Yeah, a cake or a Danish, a coffee cake, uh, croissant is very, but it, it is a very light <laughs> texture. But the filling is also very dense, like we were talking about. Each loaf weighs about a pound. Mm, and mm -hmm. in the classic pack, you'll get four loaves, so there's four pounds of deliciousness in each one. The strawberry, oh my goodness. I was telling you the story of my grandmama, who used to make strawberry cake for each of our birthdays, and it was so special. So this is something special. It's a memory when you have your friends over and they've never tasted povetizza. They're going to remember when they came down for Memorial Day or for a birthday or July 4th, this is a special. You can't find this in a bakery. That's it's handmade. These are not, it's not made by machines. So, povetizza actually means what? Uh, rolled? rolled? Rolled or swirled bread. Rolled right. or swirled. Yeah. It is, it, auto ship is gone. Oh no, I'm sorry, it's almost gone. Auto ship is outselling single ship two to one. And auto ship means that uh, you're locking in the price right now. You're locking in the $39.95 and you're locking in the free shipping and you can do it every 90 days or you can customize it so that you always have this fresh bread. I'm, they, they make it that day and then they ship it and deliver it right to your door. Look at how delicious this is. What's your favorite? My favorite is the English walnut. And if, and if you'd like, I'd love to show you how we cut it. Sure, show yeah. me how you cut it because Let's, it's, you don't just cut it like a regular loaf of bread. Right, it's a, you know, grandma taught the O'Leary's that the best way to cut the, mm, the bread mm -hmm. is by turning it upside down mm -hmm. and then cutting from the bottom up. So what we'll do is we'll cut right down the middle. And why does she cut that way? She just because it, it, it basically will keep it from keep it holding together. And what you get is you get a nice clean cut. And then at the end of that, as I reveal okay. the patterns. And see what you get there? Oh, that beautiful ribbon marbling. Exactly. Just delicious. So it's too soft on the top really to use a knife and that kind of messes up your cut. So yeah. this is a way to make it perfect. Exactly, so the top is a lot like what you were saying. It's the croissant characteristics, and then the rest of it is, it's like I said, like a Danish or almost like a pound cake. Oh my cake. goodness, this is great. Okay, so what do you have to the right of you that looks like you made a sandwich of some sort? Right, so what we've done here is we've made grilled cheese with the uh, apple cinnamon. Mm, okay. So it's kind of like the apple pie with the slice of cheese on top, but here mm -hmm. we've actually sandwiched it between two grilled them real quick, and you've got an awesome treat that you know will really entertain and, and, and fascinate a lot of the guests that you're having over the summer. I'm blown away. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just eating the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blown away of how fresh this is, the aroma as soon as you cut it. I'm standing here, and I feel like I'm, I'm at the market with all these strawberries and cherries, and, and then you have the cinnamon, but you can't buy this at a bakery. This is unique. This is handmade. This is a 100-year-old recipe. How, how special is that, right? Oh, yeah, it's awesome. This I love, is so special. I love, I, I love to, to, to hear the story that Mark and Dennis tell when Grandma was, uh, you know, leaving Eastern Europe to come to the Americas to, to look for the American dream, and all she had was her suitcase and her, and her wooden box of uh -huh. recipes. 
and you know they've used that recipe ever, ever since. Ever since, and it is a hit. So we sold out of this last July. So if you absolutely love this, lock in the auto ship so that you can get this for the summer. You can get this once a month, you can get it every 60 days, you can get it every 90 days. And you're getting all four, so you don't have to choose this goodness here. You're getting the apple cinnamon, which you can make into French toast and pour some syrup on it, ooh, and some butter. You've got that English walnut, which really put Povatitsa, the Strawberry Hill Company, on the map. That's what they're known for, that, that wonderful English walnut. 12 ounces of walnuts, white chocolate cherry. Can I get a little slice oh, of that? Oh, sure, absolutely. That white chocolate cherry, and then the strawberry cream cheese, so far, which is my favorite, just because it reminds me of what my grandmother used to make me as far as a strawberry cake. But she didn't quite have it this fancy, right. if you're listening, Grandma. Well, I loved it. But I think this has you slightly beat. But it's the um, experience of getting something that is exotic. I mean, this is coming from Eastern Europe. And it's a 100-year-old recipe. This is a family-owned business. At the, right out of Kansas City, correct? Right. Right, right. The, the heartland of America. Right. There's an area in Kansas City called Strawberry Hill where um, a lot of uh, Eastern European markets and restaurants, you know, started up, and that's where they uh, they started it as well. Okay. So this is say the name of this: the cherry. This is chocolate. the white chocolate cherry. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm telling you, get it home and try it. <laughs> you have nothing to lose. Everything's a game. Just don't eat the whole thing all at once or you'll gain a few pounds. <laughs> Auto ship is limited, very limited. So if you want that, it's it's outselling two to one. Thank you, Mr. Reyes. Well, thank, thank you, you so for much. having us. We're so yes, excited absolutely. to be back. This is wonderful, wonderful presentation. Great. Okay, also available, we have the uh, Charbroil True Infrared 3-in-1 Roaster and Smoker for $169.95. This is nearly $100 off. The original price of this is $249. Five flexible payments for you of $34. And the first time back since December, to, that's December 2016. So we've sold over 85,000 since 2009. This is so incredibly popular because you use it to roast, to smoke, to grill. Huge customer pick, so just you know, a 25 pound turkey, you can actually fry. That's what made this so popular because you don't even need any oil to fry a 25 pound turkey. You can grill your pork chops. And what about, you know, roasting those ribs? Ooh, right about now. This is wonderful and has patented technology, infrared. So the fire is on the outside of this. It has a gas burner. There's no direct flame. So that makes it more tender, more juicy. It's a customer pick for a reason. So if you've been eyeing this, Get this while it's nearly $100 off and five flexible payments because it's a Memorial Day weekend that five flexible payments, it will not last forever. It actually expires at uh, midnight. Okay, you've heard of speed dating. You heard of speed skating. What about speed grading? <laughs> <laughs> or slicing. <Yeah. laughs> or slicing. Good morning, John Florell is joining us. Now John is the perfect man. Yeah. <laughs> That's what they call him around here because he actually cleans. And he and cooks. Coach, yeah. <laughs> so this is fantastic because you're saving time. Right. And anytime to me you're saving time, uh, you're saving you're money. You're saving money. <laughs> Absolutely. Time is money. And That's right. Listen, if you you know nobody ever, I think everybody will agree. Cooking doesn't take time in the kitchen. It's all the slicing, dicing, grating, chopping. That's what takes the time. And with this new speed grater, mm -hmm. okay, you saw me slicing up the cucumber and, and carrot there. Look how thin they are. Okay? They're perfect. And look how thin. fast we filled up that bowl. That was like. Uh, there's oh my no gosh. way you could do that with a knife seconds. that fast. I know. But the way the way this works, and the reason it works so well, is okay. by that iconic company. Yeah. Well, we all seen the show Chopped. Uh -huh. Okay, this is a, a, a tried and true product by chefs worldwide, and the reason they love it is because it works and it works so fast and easy. So if you wanted to make homemade potato chips, mm -hmm. all you do is be put a potato inside here, press down, and you turn the handle. Now the way this works, okay, is there's a drum inside. There's three different drums that come with this machine. All right, so you've got your slicing drum, which I have in here. Okay. Now to change this out, if I wanted to grate instead of slice, right? Uh, all you do is on the back of the unit here, I'm gonna unlock it from the table so you guys can see. It suctions down to any smooth top, uh, countertop or cutting okay, board. Sure. So you turn the handle, it loosens up. I on like this that. side, okay, right in the back, you'll see a little tab right here on the handle. You pull this down, 
the drum pops out, okay? So for cleaning or if for changing out the drums, all you do is pop it out. That Very goes, simple. And by the way, they're stainless steel, dishwasher safe. And then you slide in whatever drum you like. If you want a grate, now you put the handle back on. And listen now, you'll hear it click, Just okay? Just pop it in. You want to pop it on there, listen. Can yeah. you hear that click? Yep. Okay, now you know it's on there. Okay. You lock it down to your countertop by turning the handle on the side. And now instead of slicing your potatoes for pan fries, home fries, or homemade potato chips, okay. watch this. And, and do that, and I'm gonna tell them what you get right here. So what you're getting is that suctioning base and handle that he just showed you. You're also getting three of the drums. So you're right. getting a fine grater, a you medium a grater, grater, and then you're getting a slicer. Yes. And then show them the pusher. Yeah, so the and the pusher, pusher, see, if you've ever used those old graters, like this old four-sided tin can thing, <laughs> okay? And well, when you, there's nothing to protect your fingers. Right. So as you're grating on one of these things, you lose I mean, or, you know. Right. <laughs> If you've ever tried this slide? Oh, oh wow. man. Yeah. Talk about skin uh, your knuckles. <laughs> yeah. So this is very, very safe for those of you who really it's love to cook. It's super safe yes. because your fingers never get close to that blade. When you get down to the end like this, okay, mm -hmm. where you would normally, uh, well, let me see if I can get that out of there. You would normally have to, you know, really watch your fingers or knuckles on, on another grater. You have this little pusher and the little pusher protects your fingers and it allows that. you to get it right down to the end so there's never any waste. And, but look at this, for zucchini bread or zucchini muffins, for uh, homemade hash browns. Here, let me switch this out. There's an entire bowl of zucchini grated and look perfectly. look how quickly you did this. If you <laughs> are wanting to, and like I was the sous chef in the family, always cutting right? up everything. <laughs> if you want it to be simple, you yeah. don't want a headache, you really want to enjoy your company, um, this is just simplifying your experience of whatever you need, cutting it up. Look, look at, at how, this. that's I mean, great. For hash brown potatoes, okay? If you like hash browns Ooh, in the morning, love, try oh, this at home. Yeah. Put a potato in there with that pusher. Look at this. You've got hash browns ready to go in the frying pan literally in That's seconds. Beautiful. Okay. Yeah, you don't have to and go these out are by the fresh. frozen kind. Yeah, they don't come out of a plastic bag. Right. Fresh is always better than frozen. It's better for you too, but it's also less expensive. Right. I mean, what do we pay for a bag of homemade potato chips when you can make them fresh? Absolutely. Right? I mean, I mean, that's what I love about it. And just for salads, here I'm gonna pop this off and I'm gonna I'm gonna take the uh, grating blade out or the okay. grating drum out. It's and also easy I'm gonna cleaning. go to yep. Yep, it's easy to easy clean. clean. Easy. Look, I'm going to go back to that slicing one, okay? okay? You hear it click. Look at this. I mean, if all if you want to slice up celery, all right, you can take one or two stalks. But if you're just sitting there in the kitchen with a knife, chopping away right. like this on a cutting board, sure. how long does that take? It takes with too long. With the speed grater, yeah. and again, this is why chefs around the world love this, because now, here, I'm going to put a bowl in the front so it catches it all. For simple. slicing, for salads, soups, stews, for barbecues, and your fingers never get close to those blades, it does the work for you. Now, if you'll notice inside the drum here, uh -huh. if, if you ever get a vegetable or something like that that gets caught up in there, uh -huh. just turn it in reverse, okay? And everything goes right into the bowl. Uh -huh. Look at that, you've got your sliced celery ready to That's go. That's perfect. And so now, he's demoing with the gray one, but you also yes. get this, I'm gonna just go over the colors for you real quick. So you get it in the red and you also get it in the white. Um, I don't know which one is most, most limited right now, but I can tell you this is a customer pick and it, uh, gray is actually the most limited and the most popular. That's neutral. You can put it in your kitchen. What a great Father's Day gift. Oh, yeah. Um, but this sold out in March, so I'm glad to have you back. It's a customer pick because it's just so much easier. Yeah, it is. And again, now I just switched out and I put the uh, the fine grating blade in. Mm -hmm. And this is the one you're going to love for breading, okay? Instead of instead of buying the, the stuff in a plastic bag or if you've ever uh, put crackers into a, a bag and then rolled it with a rolling pin. Uh -huh. Look at this. You Wait get breadcrumbs for oh, chicken, fish, nice. or meatloaf in seconds. Ooh, All you do is put some saltine casserole. crackers in top like this, or maybe you want to make a, 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 a crumb, like a, a, a pie crust. Uh -huh. All you do is turn it, and look at how much we get out of there in literally seconds. Talk about saving time. And instead of beating up that plastic bag on your countertop or tabletop, <laughs> yeah. now all you do is turn the handle. Now this is the fine grating blade, okay? All I'm doing is putting the crackers in the top. I push down on that, again, this little pusher, I call it, or the plunger. It goes in the top, you turn the handle. Your fingers never get close to the blades, but look at all the breadcrumbs we just made. Now if, awesome. you, if you want to make a pie crust, yeah. Yes, instead. I was gonna How about say, graham crackers? Yeah, your little You'll load up a shoot with grab, graham crackers like this. You've got graham cracker crust literally done in seconds. You get that super fine powdery crust. And, and again, all you do is add the other ingredients. You're ready to go. Okay. This is the thing. 
Cooking doesn't take time, baking doesn't take time. It's the, the ingredients that the go prep. into it that right. takes the time. It's the prep that takes it's, the time. It's so fast. I need to tell you that the red right now is the number one seller. So if you love red, um, there you go. It's uh, You're getting red, white, or gray. <coughs> And this is on five flexible payments, just to remind you, and also free shipping. So you get this home for under eight dollars. That is a wonderful price. Oh, Look you're going this. for the cheese. Hey, if this is, if you're, listen, if you do any Italian cooking, yes, take your Parmesan cheese, Romano, your Parmesan, uh, any hard cheese with that fine grating blade, it comes out of there like a little hurricane or a little tornado of cheese. I mean, there's an entire block of cheese, the Parmesan cheese, shredded perfectly or grated perfectly for your pastas. I mean, if you use salads, it just for that, or, yeah. <laughs> it, I mean, because and again, everybody fingers, grates cheese. Your fingers never get close to that grating blade. Right. And I'll tell you what, if that's the only thing you use it for is grating cheese, mm -hmm. I think you'll love it for that alone. Sure. But if you like, and listen, on, on taco night, take the, oh, yeah. take the, uh, the fine blade out. Uh -huh. We're going to go to the coarse one, the coarse okay. drum. Again, the handle is how you change it out. Okay, see that little tab, that red tab right there? Right. That's how you release it. I'm going to snap this one on. You can hear it click into place. Uh -huh. Now that drum's on there. Now you can take your coarse cheese, like like soft mozzarella. You can do your cheddar cheese. Ooh. You can do uh, all your softer cheeses this way it's for tacos, great. enchiladas, burritos, tostadas, and everything goes right into that bowl. Again, anything that gets clogged up inside, you just turn it backwards like this, uh -huh. and that's what cleans that drum out. Or if it's really super soft cheese, like I've had this happen at home when I do this, okay? Uh, it's If it's a super, super soft cheese, mm -hmm. you may need to take the handle off, okay? But I'll tell you, it's way faster, way faster faster than doing this with those uh, those old four-sided tin can box graters. Right. <laughs> I mean, look at the amount of and cheese you, know, you get. it's so expensive when you buy the cheese already packaged. You're paying yes. like $5 a pop sometimes. Oh, yeah. So I if mean, you why can buy, buy it, it in bulk? When you can buy yes, bulk and, and do this yourself. yourself. Exactly. And, you know, my little Shih Tzu, I have to sprinkle a little cheddar cheese on there. He only will take it if it's shredded. Right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so if you have a high-maintenance dog like I do, and he won't eat his food, you know, right? just sprinkle just a little bit on top, and that does the trick. Here's but what I love about this, this too, though. Get this home for $8. This you is great. You can do so many things with this, okay? Yes. And for ice cream toppings, take some peanuts and some M&Ms, or you can, you know, get creative, put whatever you like in there with that pusher, okay? For the kids, they love this. All you do is turn the handle. Look it grates that. walnuts, almonds, chocolate, coconut. All you do is turn the handle, and look at this. You've got ice cream toppings for yes. your cakes and pies. It's done in that seconds. In fact, here, we've got some ice cream over here. We'll just do a little sprinkle over the top. I mean, talk about a great way to, to get the kids into cooking, too. Right. I mean, if you it's, bring the kids in, you yes. set this up on the countertop, have their ice cream bowls out, they can make their own ice cream toppings this way. And again, all you're doing is putting it in the top. If you do any baking, mm. chocolate, okay? Take a block of chocolate, put it inside. Look at this. this We're this grating great chocolate idea. for your yes. cakes and pies. You get a perfect grate like this. Uh -huh. And again, get creative with this, okay? And you know, kids I, always want to help in the kitchen. This is something that's not dangerous because you, right. you have the food pusher, it's not going to cut anybody, and all they and they can crank it. All you have to yep. do is be able to all turn. All you do is if turn the handle. you have dexterity handle, right? issues, it's very simple. That's you just exactly turn right. it. That's exactly right. Yeah. Now, I, I put the, uh, the, lar the slicing blade in now instead okay. of the grating blade, yeah. and the reason is it'll give you a different type of cut, okay? So if you like your chocolate more shaved like this uh -huh. rather than grated, uh -huh. you can do that. Take some white chocolate, all right? Put it inside. Look at this. You've got That's your white perfect. chocolate, and again, for baking, for, uh, you know, for, for your cake, any type the of The toppings cooking. on your cake, the, yes. the toppings on your pies. This is the time of year where you're going to a lot of cookouts. Look how simple that is. Now, red is the most limited for you. So if you love red, just know that it's the most limited. We also have white. We also have gray. Yes. And you're getting this home for $8, five flexible payments. So if you've been wanting to try this and you've been wanting to simplify your cooking life, I would encourage you to get it home, see what you think, see if it makes life easier. I'm I'm telling you all you oh, do, it, the fact yeah. that all you do is turn this, how I easy know. is that? <laughs> hey, listen, if you, just for topping your salads, okay, how long does it take to slice radishes the for a salad? Yeah. You can load up two or three radishes in the in the, in the uh, chute like this. Uh -huh. All you do is turn the handle. You're slicing radishes safe, fast, easy. If you Maybe you have dexterity I mean, so issues. Good. You really don't have 
good knife skills. Yes. This is where you're gonna do it. And all the slices come out the same thickness because of the way it's designed. That drum does the work for you. And show if how you thin wanted that to do is. the Can radishes. Can you pick up a piece for me and show oh, yeah. how thin that sure. is? Yeah. I think it's it comes fascinating out paper how thin, thin like this, okay? Because sometimes if you do it with some of the mandolins and all that, yep. it's thicker. Yep. That's paper thin. And all you do is turn the handle. Carrots for, for uh, you know, for soups, stews, for barbecues. If you wanted to top your salads with carrots, or maybe instead of slicing your carrot, okay, maybe you'd rather grate carrot. Mm -hmm. And all you do is take the drum out with the slicing, the slicing drum. I'm going to put that, uh, the, the coarse grating drum inside. Let me clean this out a little bit. Oh, by the way, I should mention this too. If you twist this little collar, mm -hmm. that's how you get the top off for cleaning. Dishwasher safe, put it right in the top shelf, or you can just rinse it off under the hot or cold tap in the sink. Turn that collar, it locks it back down on top. And again, you just switch out the drum that you want to grate with or a slice like, with, there's a snap the handle on, yeah. and now great carrots for carrot cake, potatoes for potato pancakes or hash browns, sharp cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese, Gra for, for you know, carrots, coconut, chocolate, it grates, it, it does everything but your fingers. Yeah, <laughs> I'm glad it doesn't get your fingers, and you should know there's a one year warranty on this, so. Uh, and it we, is from Chop. It's the from Iconic Chop. show, we yes. all remember the cleaver, right? Right. And by the way, I, I think on hsn.com, you can even pick up that Iconic Chop Got cleaver. Yes. Okay, look they at have, this, again, it's like a hurricane. <laughs> <laughs> or a tornado of grated carrot. It's great it's for, again. <laughs> uh, you know, that, what do you call that, that carrot salad with the raisins in it? Yes. That's carrot, It literally yeah, is the greatest grater you'll ever grate with. Small. <laughs> it is the greatest grater you'll ever right. grate with. Was that not a, yeah, let's say that three times. The greatest grater you'll ever, you'll ever grate, grate with. with. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. It is and so much fun. It's again, simple. locks down to the countertop. It's got that suction base so it stays put wherever you want to keep it on your countertop. And all you do is put whatever you want to grate inside. Here, I'm going to do one last thing here with the, the because everybody loves cheese, right? Yes. And everybody has a hard time <laughs> grating that uh, that hard cheese like Parmesan. Right. Look at this. We just did an entire block of Parmesan cheese. That's crazy. In less than 30 seconds. Spaghetti. And all you do is turn that handle. Spaghetti, anyone. <laughs> Thank you, John. You're so much fun. We have fun. Yes. Yeah, cooking should be fun, right? It should be. The perfect man. He actually cleans up after That's, he And cooks. I clean up afterwards. That's right. <laughs> right. Thanks a lot. And we'll be right back after this, so stay with us. <laughs> Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, anyplace. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. It's HSN's Memorial Day sale, and you won't want to miss it. Enjoy these exclusive offers. Five or more flex pay on everything. 12-month VIP financing, free shipping, and five flex pay on select Beautyrest and Simmons mattresses. Plus, great deals all weekend long, with special buys every day on some of your favorite brands, like J. King, Samsung, and new arrivals from Diane Gilman. HSN's Memorial Day sale, now through Monday. Do you just love movie theater to popcorn? You may be going to see a movie this weekend because it is Memorial Day weekend. And sometimes just to celebrate the memory, if you go to a ceremony and then later on with the family may go check out a movie. Well, listen, this is movie popcorn without all the fat. Yes, we have for you Kelly Nixon's famous popper where you don't need any oil. And I'm telling you, I'm, I, I'm one for a little fat, you know, oil and butter. But I have this popcorn popper, and it is fantastic. It comes in four colors for you. So let me go over that. We have it in that canary yellow. We also have it in the Moroccan blue. And we have it in the beautiful mint, which uh, is kind of like a cross between aqua and green. And then we have it in a poppy red. I love poppy red. It's fantastic because you just put it in this glass container and like in a minute to three minutes, voila, you have perfect popcorn that is fat free. I wanna bring in Kelly Deedring because there's, it's all about the flavor. You don't have to fatten it up if you're putting all the flavors. Yeah. And I, I 
just love Kelly. I mean, she has her famous cooking show. Yes. And this is fantastic. My son loves it when I pop it and put some little, I, I melt the marshmallows. Yes. And oh, this is more oh, yeah. popcorn. Okay. <laughs> popcorn is actually a really healthy whole grain, right? But it's when we actually do the bagged popcorn with all the chemicals and the yucky yellow salt and whatever else is in there, that's when we start to get into trouble. But this is a low calorie, low carb whole, whole grain snack, okay? Uh -huh. So in three cups of popcorn, there's under 100 calories. Oh, wow. That's crazy. That's very few snacks that you can say that about. Because it but ain't 100 calories at the movies. It's, 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 it might be, it might add an extra zero onto yeah. the end of that when you go to the movie theater. There you go. But now you can have this perfectly popped popcorn using no oil. And what's so special about what Kelsey does is she gives you this wonderful guidebook with all these fun recipes. So we're going to make some of those recipes. This one, I just want to do a little bit of salt. You could do a little bit of salt, uh -huh. a little bit of butter, and you could be that popcorn purist. Are you right? a salt girl? I'm a salt and butter girl. Okay. But whole butter is okay, right? Because we know what it is. It's a right. real food. Right. It's when you start right. getting into the chemicals and the yellow butters that have, you know, artificial colors. Yeah. That's when you start getting into the trouble. Right. This is how simple and how healthy and how easy it is to do um, our Kelsey uh, Nixon popcorn And it's popcorn cute. Bowl. And look at that. It's so cute. I love that it's glass. I, uh -huh. I just hate putting plastic in the microwave. Well, they so tell I you not to. I love that it's glass. They tell Absolutely. you not to. Absolutely. Yeah. So you get that popcorn popper, uh -huh. and then it's exactly one third of a cup. So just okay. take your one third scoop and go ahead and fill it with whatever your favorite popcorn kernel is. You can actually buy all kinds of different, you know, popcorn mm -hmm. kernels, the mushroom popcorn kernel, whatever your favorite popcorn kernel is, one third of a cup. Now here's what, where you get into the fun part. You can throw it into the microwave for three minutes mm -hmm. with no butter, nothing added, and just have plain popcorn uh, to season at the yeah. end. Or I love this about Kelsey's popcorn popper. The top is vented. So you can put that pat of butter on top yes. and as it pops, uh -huh. Debbie, the popcorn melts, uh, the butter melts, and so that even the bottom kernels have the butter flavor. I love that. Have you that. ever drizzled the butter over the top? <laughs> it's all on the top. And it's only on the top, <laughs> and you have to redo the butter. Not with the Kelsey Nixon popcorn popper. You could do one pat of butter, however uh -huh. much butter you want to do. So I'm going to go ahead and pop that into the microwave, and then let's actually make some of these fun recipes sure. that Kelsey gives us. Because to me, that's where you start getting into, you know, having that healthy snack. Sure. Because I could eat an entire bag bag of salt and vinegar, you know, chips, but I don't have to. I can do salt and vinegar popcorn. Oh, so I there's that butter on top. Look at it melting onto every single kernel. To me, that's important. Even the that. little bottom layer right. has look, the butter. Look at the butter drizzling. So if you've ever watched Kelsey Nixon Essentials uh, show, you know how wonderful of a cook she is. And this also comes with a recipe book. So there's so many wonderful recipes. Because I'm not that. There's 14. Yes. I'm not that creative. I know you are. Well, let's do but, some <laughs> of them. Let's yes. do some of these and, recipes. And let's talk about which one do you like the best? Well, this one is one of my husband's favorites because everything tastes better with bacon. Right? I like the chocolate sea salt. Yes, the chocolate, chocolate sea, salt sea salt and with a little drizzle of caramel. Yes. You can make it savory or sweet, but this one is kind of to Ooh. die for. You can just cook up bacon, bacon or you can even buy the bacon already cooked. You know that commercial uh, bacon, bacon, yeah, bacon. Yeah, and then bacon. this is maple. So <laughs> this is the maple Ooh. bacon popcorn. Imagine having your friends and family over and serving maple bacon popcorn. These are the types of popcorns that you see at the restaurants. Everybody's doing gourmet popcorns at uh -huh. these restaurants and they're charging you an arm and a leg. They are. When truth be told, if you've ever priced out popcorn kernels, they're mm -hmm. pennies on the dollar. They're very inexpensive whole right. grains. So it makes more sense to get this in bulk and pop it yourself. The red is the most limited, by the way. So if you have a kitchen, you have a little theme, and you love the red, like in my kitchen, I have everything that's in the aqua family. So grab the color that really speaks to you. It's fantastic because this is made of uh, borosilicate, this glass, and so it never gets hot. Yep. So even when you take this out of the microwave, it's not going to get hot. That's what I love about it. So you just take this out. You don't have to worry about putting plastic because we're, you know, it's there's a silicone lid and we're all trying to be healthier. Yeah. You know, there's this, this big push and I got on the bandwagon late, but yes. I try not to give my son anything with plastic and well, all of that. So this works for us. Let's yeah. look at what's on the inside of a microwave bag of popcorn. And oftentimes we reach yeah. for these because they're simple. And sometimes, you know, we grab the boxes at the grocery store. But when you cut into a microwave popcorn bag, because we never really do this, look at this junk, gunk, yellow 
yellow. That's not a natural butter color. We all know what it's butter like, looks it's like. It's like, what is it? It's and like it's a lined. mystery. <laughs> the bag of popcorn is actually lined with chemicals that I can't pronounce. I right. actually can't pronounce them or right. I would. And you know, you just didn't think about that when we were kids growing up. High in calories. But now, yeah. You, I mean, you've got to be careful. You really do. So do you want to feed your body that? Or yeah. popcorn is a superfood. It's a health food. It is a natural whole grain. Yeah. It contains fiber and it contains very few carbs, about 18 grams of carbs in three cups. Mm -hmm. But most of those carbs are in fiber. Fiber is incredibly healthy. Fiber keeps us full to the next meal. So popcorn, if you do your favorite like barbecue, think of barbecue potato chips. Is that your favorite? Sour cream right. and onion potato chips. Right. Do that seasoning over popcorn and yes. you've now saved all the carbs. You have the crunch you, you want. You have the crunch you yes. want. Let's do the s'more one you were talking Let's about. Do so I know. This is I've one got of the ones I don't know where that bacon went. It went too uh, fast. No, I gotta try I, it. We've got it. I'll <laughs> hand it to you. But this one is, you know, those little cinnamon crunchies. This uh -huh. is cereal. So you can yes. buy those little cinnamon crunchies. Look at the mini marshmallows that you get for, you know, like the Ooh, chocolate, yes. um, hot chocolate. Look at just some chocolate chips, okay? And then this is just melted marshmallow. Oh, you could do melted do. marshmallow yes. and caramel. However you want to make your s'more popcorn, mm -hmm. what a decadent dessert, right? So how unique and healthy, and then just give it a little swirl around the edges. And make. you could even make little popcorn balls with this because look yes. how sticky and look yummy at, that is. And it's, it's better than one of those treats with the rice. You know what I'm talking about. Yes, <laughs> it is. It's but healthier. You're getting a whole grain. Yeah, absolutely. Let me taste you want it. that one? Yes. Okay, I'm going to give you that okay, one. Okay, let me taste this one. What I love about it, too, is, you know, your grandkids are coming over. This is a project you can do together. Yep. You know, honey, what kind of popcorn do you want? Well, Grandma, I want the marshmallows and all that. You get all the ingredients, and it's something you can do together because this glass doesn't get hot. That's what I love about it. And it's all these create 14 recipes. Mm. So that's that borosilicate silicate that you're talking about. It's a non-porous glass. It's the highest quality glass that you mm, can cook this, in. Oh, girl. One third of a cup, if you're just joining us, you take your one third scoop, isn't that amazing? You take your oh. little one third scoop and you do your favorite popcorn kernel. Oh. And popcorn kernels, more often than not, are on BOGO. So grab a couple of them. You can add a pat of butter at the top. I'm gonna go crazy and I'm gonna add two pads of butter because I really like butter. Yes. And in fact, butter is a whole food, right? It's a real food. It yes. just, it's, you know, mm. butter is butter. It's not margarine. So you're good to it's go good there. Stuff. It's not the yellow chemically stuff they do at the movies. And I'm not saying don't ever buy movie popcorn. No. I'm gonna buy movie popcorn when I'm good. at the movies. Okay, but what is this I'm one again? Home, that's the s'mores. You've got to do the s'mores, folks. <laughs> I'm telling you, I, I was skipping a little bit. I mean, look at that. It's gorgeous. Isn't and that it's beautiful? wonderful. And okay, so look at how simple it is. You just Hit put a third cup of popcorn in this beautiful glass jar, if you will. And then you put just a little bit of butter on top, and it gets it gets all over the popcorn, not just the top. And it's ready, depending on your microwave, the power of your microwave. Yeah, it's usually one, one, to half, th yeah. one to three minutes. But when you start to hear it slowing down with the popping. You but don't even have to use uh, oil, you guys. You, mm. you can do zero oil. Or you this can do was, coconut oil. You could do coconut, which makes it a really good tip. I love yeah. that you said that. Coconut oil makes it Healthy. extra fluffy. Um, okay, so let's do another savory one. Okay. Let's do the let's garlic do. parmesan Ooh. rosemary. Yeah, because I'm, I'm a salt girl. I, I like too. olives and pickles and all right. that kind of stuff. So I'm glad you're doing that one. So we already added a little butter we're gonna add a little more right so this is at the end remember popcorn only has about 60 calories in a cup yes three cups is roughly 100 you know 120 calories mm -hmm. garlic salt to top it with okay Ooh, this is something it. that you would get at those restaurants where they yes, serve the and then parmesan cheese and you know when you get popcorn in a tin and it's all fancy you go to these fancy stores that. I mean you spend $30 for a tin of popcorn Easily. because it's special Easily. let me taste this for you yeah I'm, tell I'm, me I'm how I'm that garlic taster. are you a garlic girl because oh, you gotta yeah. be a garlic person oh. to do the garlic parm um, and garlic, the rose. I put garlic on my eggs <laughs> oh good she's oh, she's definitely a garlic girl let's make another really recipe good. so it's really good and it comes out really perfectly fluffy mm. every time I don't know if you can see it's that air popped look oh and I love um, the salt yes mm. isn't yeah. it amazing it's amazing so just remember that it's a healthy food, popcorn is. We've It's what we've done to popcorn. Put it in the baggies with the chemicals and the yellow coloring. And how coloring. much does this make? So this will make up to eight cups. Okay. So when this is full, up to eight cups and, of popcorn. And that's a lot of popcorn that's for the a whole lot family. Of, I mean, the average person would eat about three cups of popcorn, which is under yeah. 100 calories. So that's like two and a half people, three people. And you're only putting, what, a third of a cup in? A third of a cup of the kernels, your favorite popcorn eight kernels. eight cups. Yeah. <laughs> that's amazing. All right, this is butter and then your favorite wing sauce. Ooh. So melt your butter. Oh. 
and then your favorite wing sauce. This is a hot wing popcorn, right? Hot. So butter and your favorite wing sauce goes right over the, over the top, and then this is celery salt, right? Because you have the one. How genius is this? Like my sweet little hubby, he's, yep. he's already lost 20 plus uh, oh, pounds. Yeah. Congratulations, Yay. Richie. Um, but you know, he loves the hot wings. Yes. So instead of eating the hot wings with the buffalo Pride. sauce, you get that same flavor with the popcorn. So it's all about being creative. It's all up to your imagination. Exactly. And again, your red is your most limited. You get the canary yellow. You also get the beautiful Moroccan blue and mint. So whatever complements your kitchen. These are also wonderful housewarming gifts. They're great gifts. You, Grab a wedding a, gifts. Yes, you know, absolutely. I mean, you would spend Father's Day. $20 for a few months on the bag popcorn. Get away from the bag popcorn. Um, it contains stuff that I can't pronounce. That's never a good thing. You know, if, uh -huh. if you look at the label, um, you can see all the gunk in it. It's nasty. It's chemically. You don't want to do that. It's a Just mystery. It's a mystery. It's like the movie you're going yes. to dun 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 dun. <laughs> It's yeah. like, what's in that bag? <laughs> That's the name of the movie. Yeah, this is this is one of Kelsey's favorites. I always hear her talking about, she's got two kids, uh -huh. and I always hear her talking about them and doing the birthday cake popcorn. So this oh, wow. is melted white chocolate, okay? All, I mean, a lot of these mm. are so simple. You're getting 14 recipes coming so included. Good. So that's melted white chocolate, and then all the sprinkles your little heart imagines. Oh, my goodness. Birthday cake popcorn instead of a birthday cake that's, at a birthday party. Oh, instead of... Um, um, that, you know, it's less sugar. Exactly. All those kids yeah. driving you crazy. <laughs> Oh, this one is so cool. This says ready to pop for a baby shower. If you're Aww, hosting a baby shower, how cute is you, that? all you need to do is melt the blue or the pink mm -hmm. chocolate, drizzle it over your freshly popped popcorn. That's a very, right. this probably costs like less than a that's, penny. I mean, you know cute. what I mean? It doesn't cost this very much so to make the cutest absolute you're baby so shower creative. gift. So even if you have, you know, kids or grandkid going off to college, this is something you can give them. They can have their oh, healthy your snacks. Maple bacon. <gasps> this is the bacon. Remember we did the oh, maple bacon at the top okay. of the presentation. Mm. You guys are really going to enjoy this popcorn. Oh, my popcorn. goodness. Have fun with it. Mm. Healthy, healthy, healthy snacks. This is so good if you love bacon. <laughs> I can't stand it. We'll be right back. <laughs> There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. Flex Pay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. Who knew a little piece of plastic could be so much fun? Now, when you apply for the HSN card, instantly get $10 off. It's all about you. Extra flex on the things you love. Now, when you use your HSN card, you get extra flex all day, every day on all jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases. Plus, no interest VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, all with no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. What's in a name you say? Well, Elite Bistro Elite, hey, speaks for itself. This is the number one selling kitchen appliance company, and they're known for the pressure cookers, but now the famous air, air fryer. I'm so excited about this because it's touch screen. Yes. Why is that important, Kelly? Well, I mean, <laughs> let's be honest. It's so much easier to have that digital interface. We also provide pictures, right? So you can choose from a picture or uh -huh. you can, you know, program your own time. You can see that's actually the temperature. Now, air fryers that cost twice the price of ours have a manual dial up. Okay? There's, uh, there's one online right now that's yep. $250 exactly. that claims to be a top seller, and this is under $99. Look at that. Is that a whole chicken? So the problem with air fryers is that traditionally they're relatively small. And that's the number one complaint about the two and three hundred dollar right. air fryers. It, you it, can fit a single sandwich inside. But them. not this chicken. Elite Bistro decided to change all that. So okay. you know us from our pressure cookers, one of the number one selling pressure cookers here at HSN. And Elite Bistro has finally designed an air fryer that isn't gonna break the bank, I can't but can believe serve it. a whole family. Get out! That's a five pound. <laughs> air fried chicken That's if you never had an air fried oh. chicken please jump in and try this for at I least 30 days i smell the rosemary it's it amazing is beautiful. I'm, I'm really surprised at how beautiful it is i'm not gonna lie it is because gorgeous. you're thinking an air fryer how is this going to come out 
you've got to get it home and try it yourself. This is $20 on FlexPay. Five flexible payments. And I have to remind you that that expires Monday at midnight. So if you're serious about getting this home and trying it, you're getting it home for 20 bucks. If you go and get a rotisserie chicken at oh. one of your grocery stores. If you do that twice, you, I mean, <laughs> you paid for the flex pay. Yeah, yeah. you're going to pay $8 Easily. for it. It's not going to be as good. So you just saw me lifting the basket out. This chicken right. doesn't sit in its own juice. It's crunchy and crispy, but look at the moisture, okay? Look at how tender that white meat is. Now, white meat is traditionally the very, do you see it dripping? It's actually dripping with juice because of the right. way that the air fry process happens. Right. It's so delicate, but then the outside, you get that crispy chicken skin that everybody loves about fried now, chicken. And, and explain to me, uh, so if you've never used an air fryer and this is new to you, how, how does this produce the, the crispiness without oil? That's a great point. So air frying is technically frying, right? right? Can I get a, a, a fork and a knife? Yeah, Somebody here, I have out a there. fork. Because I want to taste this. Okay. Got <laughs> your fork, my girl. Let that okay. cool off. Let I'll let it cool see. off. Okay. But air frying is technically frying with hot air instead okay. of oil. Okay. So if you're trying to eliminate the oil from mm -hmm. your diet, if you're just trying to do fried foods maybe once a month instead of once a week, an air fryer was at everybody's choosing. But up until now, they've been $250, $300, $350. Elite Bistro is changing the game. They're giving us a large capacity air fryer that can mm -hmm. do a full chicken, but it's not going to break the bank. It gives you the option to get your toe wet and try air frying. So you still get the right. crisp crunch, right? You still get what that what we crave in right. fried foods. Ooh, um, this is, oh my gosh, that this grilled is going to be, this is oh. a triple grilled cheese, okay? Let me show you. We've got Parmesan cheese, we've got cheddar cheese, and we've got mozzarella cheese. And look Perfect. at how Perfect. Do you, you, in no frying pan, you didn't have to add any butter. You can delicately, you know, coat the outside with a little cooking oil Beautiful. if you choose. But the beauty of air frying, especially with the Elite Air Fryer, is that you don't have to coat it with any oil. And you can don't you show them with this red one that there's oil underneath that doesn't go into your body? Uh, yes. It, it goes at That's the, what the, I was showing when yes. we did that. When I lifted that basket out, so that, that basket comes included, obviously, that's that, that air fry basket. Look at the oil that that chicken, that naturally produced, it's not going in your body. You're not eating You're it. You're not eating that oil. You don't oil. have to eat it. Exactly. So, honey, I know we've, I've been on this, like, monetary diet, but... <laughs> We're gonna get this. Yeah, because he's on a roll. Are you on a monetary <laughs> diet too, girlfriend? You don't want to do both at the same time. Well, I just shop every every time I present something, I'm buying something. But we need this because, like I said, he, he's lost over 20 pounds, and we're trying to eat healthier. And when you, if you think about it, you know, when your doctors are telling you, you know, less salt, you know, less sugar less oil, less fat, this helps you do that. Yes, this, it does. It, it, it just you're makes not, it easier. You, well, you're not dunking it in oil. These, okay, let's be honest, this is a bad time to talk about these because these are not exactly healthy, mm. but they are gonna make, they are fr they're gonna be fried mac and cheese balls. I'm tasting this chicken, girl. But no oil, <laughs> so you are hard. technically still frying them okay. with air, and that's the thing. The superheated so. air spins all around the inside of this machine. It's mm -hmm. super hot. It goes up to 392 degrees, right? Mm -hmm. There's that digital interface, mm -hmm. and and there's a fan on the inside that spins it so that it crisps up every morsel of your food. Okay, there's the temperature. I can go all the way up to um, 392 degrees, and then when I want to go to that time, there you mm -hmm. go, there's my temperature. Let's go all the way up for my time, and I'm gonna hit start. And there it starts on its own. It's that digital interface. I now, love most that. air fryers that cost twice what we cost, yes. you have to dial it up, mm -hmm. and you're not really sure what setting. Some of them even just say high, medium, low. Right. Ours is exactly Exact it's temperatures. Precise. And then it's we precise. even have pictures on the top. For example, right. frozen French fries, 392 degrees. Homemade French fries, like a traditional potato, mm -hmm. um, 392 degrees for 16 to 20 minutes. Chicken nuggets, 6 to 10 minutes. Chicken thighs, if you want to do like fried chicken pieces, 18 minutes. And then the hamburger patties, which I know our producer Paul made in his air fryer just yesterday. Oh, yesterday. Yeah, 356 degrees. Now, Paul, most people Paul, are, has, Paul has this. He okay. does. And most people are thinking, I'm a hamburger patty? Why would right. I do an air fried hamburger? patty this isn't just for traditional fried foods it's for everything because it's moist I'm, I'm eating this chicken oh my gosh I'm trying not to eat so fast wings. it is so 
moist. Oh and look my at those gosh. chicken wings. So oh my we did this beautiful mm. Asian mm. sauce mm. on these wings. Mm -hmm. Look at how crunchy and crispy. If you put this in front of a plate of hungry guys or gals, you right. know, maybe you're having a party, they would not be able to tell you whether these were deep fried in oil or whether these were air fried. They wouldn't. They look they like dry you took them off the grill. I mean, look at how look at gorgeous that. these are. Now, look Just at great. how much capacity I have as well. So I really love this for those foods that we crave that we would traditionally go buy, you know, the 20 gallon bag of oil, or the box of oil, or the, you know, jar of oil, right. however you purchase your oil. We'd have to figure out, you know, where to put the oil after we were done using it in a deep fryer. Instead, I can air fry oh my, my chicken wings. In my Elite Air one. Fryer, you're talking more than two dozen. <laughs> I think there's about 30 wings there. You wouldn't even be able to get that in a traditional deep fryer. At least most of the deep fryers I've ever met wouldn't mm -hmm. be able to hold that many wings. Try it. Get it home. So and it's 5.6 quarts. Yes. So this is larger than most of the air fryers you see out there. Like I said, I, you know, I price one online because yep. I like to know you know, when I'm presenting something, what's out there? And there's one and out you there, find? Yeah, two. $250, mm -hmm. and this one is, is under $100, and you get it home for $20. It's crazy, and it's large, so that you can put a whole five-pound chicken in it and feed the whole family. And there's the oil that drips down that you're not. Now, if you want to cook with that oil, and a lot of people save that oil, it's tasty, but you don't yeah. have to use it, and you don't have to eat it in your mm. chicken wings. And this I think that good. that's really important for folks mm -hmm. that are trying to cut out, you know, a lot of the fats. That's an easy easy way to cut out one of the fats. Now, this Good. is a full bag of the frozen crispy french okay. fries. Most air fryers would be take about a third, even like, you know, a fourth of this bag, okay, right. based on capacity. So, you know, I like to go big or go home, and then if I want to go small, I have that option to go small, uh -huh. right? So you pop it in, your little basket, and then that front automatically starts to come on. I can go to my menu and select from whatever I want to select from. That happens to be seafood. That happens to be fish. Oh, look at that. It's literally a picture of French fries I love flashing it. at yes. me. And then all I have to do is hit start. It's pre-programmed to know I'm doing French fries. And that's why you want the touch screen. Yes. For those of you at home who's like, oh, I don't understand that. It's too fancy for me. No, it's, it's so it's, simple. It, it simplifies your life because, you know, you're not taking those fries out of the freezer and dumping it into a fryer with all the oil. And then what do you do with the oil? You hit a button on yes. here that tells you, are you doing frozen fries? Are you doing homemade fries? And it tells you exactly, you know, how to cook it. You just hit the button. All right, girl, these are, um, I know you're from Texas. Do you guys do? Ooh. Do you guys do fried green tomatoes? Yes, in Texas. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. we fry everything. Oh. You gotta go to the state fair in Texas. We, oh. we fry Twinkies. Oh, <laughs> fried green tomatoes. You can see we're doing little sliders, right? Ooh. We do a little bacon, a little arugula on uh -huh. these little sliders. What a decadent summer sandwich! Oh, and you're getting yeah. your vegetable right there as well. Where'd you get those big tomatoes? Oh, those uh, are a lot of times they're in season right now. In the grocery stores, you can get these beautiful green tomatoes, and you can do your own breading, right? So you do a little egg wash and then whatever breadcrumbs or breading you want to do yeah. and it becomes this beautiful healthy treat because you're not frying it in oil and then you can do like a little ranch cilantro or whatever kind of sauce you would like but can you imagine serving fried green tomato sliders for oh. you know a little summer barbecue I mean they'll think you ordered this that you they you will. know that you catered it but listen you get a recipe book and you get uh, 26 recipes so you're not alone if full this color. is your first time in full color so here are some of the recipes that we have on there for you. The fried green tomatoes that Kelly just talked about, homemade black pepper potato chips, uh, beer battered uh, fish fillets, Cajun chicken, a skirt steak with cilantro. How about putting making your tacos with that, with a little garlic sauce, and even dessert, a mini cheesecake. Yeah, isn't that I mean, great? A cheesecake in an air fryer? You gotta well, be kidding me. Well, there's so many dessert recipes <laughs> now for me. air fryers. I had wow. to come back to these. I wanted to let them sort of cool a little. Yeah, I was trying to eat my wing, but it was pretty hot. Do you hear that crisp, that oh my crunch? Gosh. Okay, you didn't get out a frying pan. You didn't have to do any extra effort on this stovetop you're saving energy because you haven't had to turn on your stovetop or your oven and look <gasps> at how perfectly cooked that grilled cheese is, is. It really hot it is beautiful. Oh, can I get a bite no it's I, that's oh. why I let it cool because oh. I wanted to feed Debbie oh yes what a beautiful breakfast look at, oh yeah this looks good. grilled cheese yeah. for breakfast nothing better than Oh, really? And it's a triple grilled cheese, so we did parm on the outside. And there's outside. no butter? Yeah, you know no, how, you know parm how you on the outside to crunch it up. Yes. This Isn't is that really, amazing? Yes, and it's oh, perfect. behind you, girl.
It's perfect. It's perfectly crunchy. You can, if you want to dust anything with oil or give it a spritz or a spray, the spray oils um, by Spray uh, Simply Beyond here at HSN are great oh, in the air true. fryer. I have those. They, they crunch everything up with giving it so that good. beautiful seasoning. Oh my goodness. Um, so that's in my little tip. Okay, this one I really like, especially now the royal wedding happened. <laughs> Everybody's all into, you know, mm -hmm. looking at British tradition. Nothing more traditional than sitting in an English pub th than fish and chips, right, Paul? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I wish you could hear our. our our okay. Paul's accent. Yes. I, Paul, were you at the royal wedding? I feel like you must have. Oh, he was in Spain. Okay, okay, got it. And Paul All right. is from England. Oh, yes. I love his accent. I do too. And look at the fish and chips that you can do. I'm going to put my fish on top and pour my chips on the bottom. And then we've got vinegar here, which I know is super <coughs> traditional as well. But can you imagine no oil used? You can do your own beautiful fish if you'd like. Look how or you beautiful can, that is. And you could even get the, you know, the fish in the frozen section that's already they breaded. They have some good ones. They, they do. They have some good ones that, you know, are organic and that cook great. How what I can tell you, what I'm noticing about this, Kelly, is the crunch is extra crispy. Yep. So if you've been looking to slim down and a lot of folks, you know, it's hot outside, you're trying to slim down in the summer and eat a little healthier, you can get the taste of anything fried. Yeah. And it's crispier. Yeah. You get that crunch, which satisfies. But I'm, I'm telling you, this grilled cheese sandwich is Did I make the your bomb. <laughs> <laughs> I made her day. It's the bomb. I mean, it's so crispy. It is. It's crispy. It's and you crunchy. don't need any oil. We didn't have to pat it down in all this butter. It's great. Well, and I think that's important if you're trying to get healthy and you don't want to dunk things in a vat of hot right. oil. And maybe you do fried foods a couple times a week. It's you great. can eliminate that. I'm certainly never saying never go to a restaurant and order, right. you know, oiled, you know, deep fried oil, chicken wings. You can certainly do that, be my guest. Eliminate it a couple of times, maybe a month or a week. You will start to notice it in your waistline and the way you feel. You ever had like the deep fried foods? You just start yeah. to feel guilty, you feel heavy, you've ingested that oil. Mm. Try air frying for a, just a couple of you know days, meals, weeks, whatever you wanna do. I'm telling you. You will notice a difference. This is such a cool one. Now this is, have you ever had a scotched egg? No. Okay, a lot of people have. I okay. love oh, hanging out with you. I know, so this one's fun. What is a scotched egg? I cannot take credit for it. This was our chef, Renee, that came up with doing the okay. scotched egg and the air fryer. Okay. I need to find a knife. Okay, here, here's my knife. This is so but good. But what it is, is it's actually breaded, and then it's an egg on the inside, and then you can see how beautiful that is wrapped in, um, in pork. So it's breaded pork with the scotched <laughs> egg on the middle. Oh and you can goodness. do that in your air fryer, my friend. Is this an Irish thing? Yeah, um, Scottish. Scottish. It must be I was Scottish. Close. Okay. Yes, yes, I, a, a scotch scotched egg. egg. Look at that. Look at how decadent, how beautiful, and how perfect that is. Oh my goodness. I mean, that I mean, is such is... a neat thing to be able to do that bread it because you still yes. get that crunch of the fried, uh -huh. but you're not deep frying it. And traditionally, these would be deep fried. You're eliminating having to deep fry things in oil. Don't get me wrong, you're still frying right you're just frying with hot air it's and the, that's important it's the circulation of the hot air so that it's even so you get this home for twenty dollars and you're basically eating fried food with no guilt you're not having to worry about all the sodium and the fats um, or, or any of the sugar if that's your thing but you can fry anything. I mean, French fries without the guilt. Yes. I mean, that's that's an American favorite. Just a traditional bag of French fries. Now, I this mean, is this is where our capacity comes into play here. I've got a taste of here. these Scottish Can eggs. you see that we have these little bread baskets, these little bread baking trays? Oh Two of them have fit inside <laughs> our air fryer. Nothing tastes better than beautiful loaves of bread done in your air fryer. If you own the little Gorgeous. bread... I mean, no air fryer, to my knowledge, could ever do a loaf of bread. This That's is beautiful. a game changer, my friends. This is like a rosemary focaccia bread, and then we've done like a cinnamon bread. But look at how perfectly cooked it's, those are. I mean, it's perfect. The browning is perfect. These Scottish eggs. Scottish, are they right? Yeah, Scottish, Scottish eggs. Scotch, Scotch, uh, eggs. Scotch, yes, Scotch eggs. eggs yeah. So it has this little bit of crunch. And then it has, like, if you love sausage, you, the taste of, of your breakfast sausage with the egg and it's fried. I mean, this is delicious. Oh, can you imagine this? It's so fresh, creative. So, fresh baked bread with a little bit of <sighs> butter, a little bit of warm jelly or jam on that cinnamon bread. This is so good. Is that tasty? Mm -hmm. Are you glad? We, I'm glad we got to feed you this morning. Oh, my morning. gosh. <laughs> this is breakfast, girl.
All right, so this, this one good. is really cool. So this is actually a beef wellington. Now, you can have as much mm. fun as you want with an air fryer. Sure. It is a traditional oven. You can do mm -hmm. all the things that you would do in your oven, but guess what? You're not heating up a big oven. Right, right? and getting hot in and your house. So every time I turn on my oven, you can see, let me see if I can get this from underneath. You can see that you're turning down your air conditioning, right? You're turning right. it down because your oven is so warm. Right. You don't have to do that with an air fryer. It it takes very little energy to run any air fryer, but right. the Elite Air Fryer happens to be large. It takes very little energy to run that as well. And this, uh, and red is the most limited, I have to tell you. So black is, is selling like crazy right now, but as far as what we have in stock, red is your most limited. So just choose your color that you want and get it home and try eating fried foods for the first time without the guilt. Even if you're not trying to lose weight, it's just healthier when everyone is watching their cholesterol and blood pressure and all of that. Doctors Great will tell points. you it's common sense to try not to eat many fried foods. A lot of us allow, oh, we'll just eat fried foods on the weekend. What if on the weekend you're still cooking at home and studies always show that when you cook at home, you're, you are eating less calories. You know exactly what you're putting in it. Look at that beef wellington. Is that amazing or is oh. that amazing? So, you know, you can just do everything as simple from a bag of frozen french fries, a bag of frozen popcorn shrimp, a bag of frozen chicken nuggets for the kids or grandkids, to something as sophisticated, but still quite easy as a beef wellington. That's beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? It's beautiful. It's just a puff pastry, your beautiful cut of beef. You can see their spinach around the outside, but look at the interior. Look at the moisture, look at the juice. I mean, imagine serving that for dinner, not even having to turn on an oven and being able to do it inside your Elite Bistro air fryer. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Kelly, girl, I can't even talk. What should I save you? I'm gonna eat the beef. Eat, eat that, <laughs> eat that. Okay, Bobby is all beauty coming up next.